Let's see what we got. Is this Tristan? Where did he go? Yeah. There you are. Hi, Tristan. Mm. What happened to your voice? <laughs> oh. yeah, Is that what happened to your voice? Yeah. When you breathe in, it goes. Is <sighs> 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 that what you do too? Yeah. When did that start? This morning when you yeah. woke up? So you were fine yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. So you know what's Daddy, happening? Daddy? You've got a little viral infection. Uh, there's different viruses that cause some swelling right here. And then it makes you hoarse. And you go, oh, 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 oh. like that. Croup always gets worse at night. So in this situation where you've got a significant strider, that noise that you have, we're gonna do a little bit of a steroid. Now you can do an oral prednisolone, you can do oral, oral decadron, the same one that's used to inject. You can also give orally, which is what we're gonna do today. You don't have to give as much. Prednisolone tastes horrible. There are things like orapred, which comes in a dissolved tab or a liquid, tastes a little better. Anyway, you have a classic case of croup. It is a viral thing. You do not need antibiotics for viruses, folks. You just need to add moisture to the air, so a humidifier it can be hot or cold. And sometimes if it's really misty out, you just go outside. You, some people drive into the hospital with a window down in the mist and they get better. They get to the hospital, they're all better. Um, but we're gonna get some humidification going for him, a, a steroid to decrease the inflammation in the airway. And folks, that's a case of croup. Thanks for watching and thanks for uh, sharing with us today. Croup, by the way, tends to be this time of year around Thanksgiving, Christmas time. <laughs> Very good, thank you.